fewer people are dying from breast cancer. That's according to a report from the American Cancer Society. But the latest numbers from the organization show disparities continue to significantly impact the health of black women. In honor of Breast Cancer Awareness Month tonight, we are looking at the racial gap that remains and what some say needs to be done to close it. Improved research, better treatments and screenings have all led to fewer people dying of breast cancer. The peak year was 1989, and since then, breast cancer mortality has actually fallen by 43%. But the latest numbers from the American Cancer Society aren't shifting fast enough for black women. The organization says overall, a black woman is about 40% more likely to die from breast cancer than a white woman. If you're a black woman between the ages of 20 and 29, you're actually at a double the risk of dying from breast cancer than a white woman of the same age. The American Cancer Society says it's important to make sure health care is adequate for everyone. Women of color, particularly black women, are not always uh, have their mammograms or facilities are the best, not always called back as appropriately they are, and not always given the same opportunities for some of our newer therapies. Screenings are key, but the organization says there was a dip in mammograms during the height of the pandemic, while over a million fewer people went to their annual screening. It's important. If you do have cancer, we find it really early because then we can do something about it. Well, this Breast Cancer Awareness Month, the American Cancer Society has started a campaign called Grab Your Girls. It's aimed at encouraging women to make breast cancer screening a priority for themselves, their family and their friends.